Welcome back to the channel. I'm Elo. Today is a very exciting day because we're starting a new series on all of our bikes. And today we're kicking off the top five reasons why I ride a 2017 Norco range instead of any other trail bike in the world. So let's get into it. This bike is really special to me, and if you have a bike that's special, please comment it down below and why. Okay, now onto the top five. Reason number five why I ride a 2017 Norco Range Extra Small is the wheel size. These are 27.5 wheels, and I love 27.5. They roll much faster, and they're also ma maneuverable. This is my first 27.5 bike, and I love it and you get a lot more choice of tires. So my favorite uh, match for tires is Minion DHF in the front with max grip for extra grip, then Minion DHR2 Max Terra in the back for a little bit higher rolling. I'm running EXO for light sidewalls and tubeless, and they are tubeless ready. Um, so I run 22, about 22 PSI in the front and 24 in the rear. I used to run inserts. I don't anymore because they're just too heavy. So now onto the rims. If you want to see my sister build some of these rims, click up there. So the rims are Flow Mark Stands, Flow Mark Four rims. They're my favorite rims because they're asymmetrical. So the um, spoke tension is more or less the same. So the nipples are red, white, and blue aluminum. I have Sapum race spokes and a Hope Pro 4 hub. Reason number four why I ride a 2017 Norco Range extra small is that it's mostly carbon fiber. This is carbon, this is carbon, this is carbon, but this is a aluminum bar just for strength. Also what's carbon, are my Samox M7J cranks. Link in the description for an entire video on that. They come in 145 and 155. These are the 145 millimeter cranks and they saved a pound. So moving on to the cassette and rear derailleur, I have a Shimano XTR cassette and a SRAM XG1195 lightweight cassette. This is my favorite cassette and I've had it for three bikes, this is its third bike, and it hasn't worn that much for me, but maybe that's just because I'm really lightweight. And then also, I have these titanium bolts on my brake levers, great brake calipers, brake rotors, and water bottle bolts. We work really hard to make these videos, so please like and subscribe, it would really help us out. Okay. Now let's finish the top five. Reason number three why I ride a 2017 Norco Range Extra Small is that it has a lot of suspension. So it has 160 millimeters in the back and 170 in the front. So my rear shock, they're both Fox. My rear shock is a Flow X Kashima coat. I have seven clicks from all the way open on my low speed. And then my pedal switch is off. so it's not in pedal mode. My rebound is all the way open. I have max volume spacers. Even though I'm light, I still bottom it out sometimes, even with 100 PSI. Okay, that's a shock. Now let's go into the fork. I have high speed and low speed compression, high speed and low speed rebound, and those, the, both of those are all the way open. And then I'm running 55 PSI, which is the minimum. I should get my fork custom tuned, but I just haven't gotten around to it. Reason number two why I ride a 2017 Norco range is the price. These bikes are from 2017, so they're used, and Norco doesn't make them anymore, which is kind of sad, because I love this bike. But you can still get them used, but make sure you know the history of the bike before you buy a used one. And you can look on Pink Bike or wherever you want to look. But the one defect of that is that Norco didn't make that many extra small frames. So you'll have to look pretty hard to find one. The number one reason why I ride a 2017 Norco range 
extra small is the geometry. This bike is tiny. So the reach, which is from the bottom bracket to the head tube, that is only 385 millimeters. The chain stay, which is from the bottom bracket to where the axle goes on your wheel, is only 420 millimeters. And then the wheelbase is only 1,120 millimeters. And then the head tube angle is 65. In comparison, the Transition Scout Extra Small is a inch longer reach, a inch longer wheelbase, and it also has an inch less travel. Commensal Clash Extra Small, which is a mullet 26, 27.5, is, hear this, a inch longer reach, 10 mil longer chainstay, and like two inches longer wheelbase. That's massive, and it, it has a smaller real wheel. The closest one we could find is the Santa Cruz Nomad 2020. So this had about the same reach. Uh, the chain stay was 10 millimeters longer, but it had an inch, more, 10 millimeters more travel. That's because the entire rear linkage is different, but, and the wheelbase is a little bit longer. There's a table up here, so if you want to pause the video to look at all of these, you can. Okay. And then one disadvantage is that the standover height is pretty big because the shock is mounted vertically instead of like horizontally like this. Those are the top five reasons why the Norco Range 2017 Extra Small is the best bike if you're moving from 24 or 26 to 27.5. Click here if you want to see me riding this bike and click here if you want to see me polishing it and click here if you want to subscribe. Thank you. Bye.